The most common misconceptions about a home birth are that it's unsafe, it's very messy and it's only undertaken by hippies, all of which are untrue. <laughs> Home birth is safe because you have midwives supervising you just as you would do in the hospital. Um, there aren't any, we don't take any unnecessary risks at home. The midwives are there to monitor your well-being and baby's well-being and if we have any concerns we act upon them straight away, making home birth very safe. The secret to a smooth, easy birth. Try hypnobirthing, being calm and relaxed having the people around you that you want to have around you and staying at home as long as possible. If something goes wrong at home, then we do act upon it straight away. Things very rarely go wrong in the blink of an eye. We tend to get signs. So if something goes wrong at home, we stay nice and calm. We call the hospital to let them know that we're on our way and we make our way in an ambulance. Even if it's not something really serious, um, we do go in as quickly as we can to make sure that mum and baby are kept really safe. As a midwife, if I had the choice now of having a baby at home or in hospital, it would definitely be home, just because I know that it's more conducive to normal labour and birth. In my experience, home birth isn't messy at all. Um, we make sure that there's lots of coverings around uh, the house and also there's a liner in the pool. And as midwives, it's part of our job after a birth to clean up, take all our rubbish away with us and your house should really be left exactly as we found it. So I don't really think there is any mess involved. <laughs> What's the best thing about home birth? From a midwife's perspective, for me, it's certainly about being in a special place with the woman where she wants to birth her baby in a calm, relaxing. If the mother is bleeding at a home birth, we are trained in emergency procedures and manoeuvres to deal with that. We also carry emergency drugs with us that we can administer to a mother if she starts bleeding. These are Sintometrin, Sintosinol and Ergometrin. Each home birth is different and unique um, in its own right, but the most unusual and wonderful thing actually I've ever had happen at a home birth is an £11.5 baby being born in the pool. Lovely, normal, calm birth. Um, so that was really special and quite unusual. <laughs> If the cord is around the baby's neck, it's not usually anything to worry about. Babies being born with a cord around the neck is quite common um, and we don't tend to do anything for it because th there isn't really much we can do. Babies have plenty of oxygen so long as they're inside and their placenta's attached, so it's not something that we tend to get too worried about at home or in hospital. I would sum up home birth in a few words. Calm, peaceful, relaxing, family orientated and extremely special. <laughs>